Good morning. Good morning. Happy Independence. We are now 50 years old as a country. Good morning. You look good. You look good. <laughs> but you know we try. 49 plus 1. 48 <laughs> plus 2. Yeah. 50 plus 0 or what? You are you in the fair? However you won't put it. We here. We here. Yeah, we we here. Up for your age. We here. Mm. You know all the electronic shit. Fifty is nifty. <laughs> <laughs> Not the poet and he don't know it. Ah, boy, what a time. Good oh, morning to time. everybody. You are tuned into the Longest Running Cultural Show in the Bahamas that talks everything culture, but especially <laughs> highlighting John Canoe. Welcome to Junkaloo 242. Two. Good morning, Ali. Officially, how are you? Good today? morning. It's good to be here. Oh my. You know, Ali, this is the second week in a row. Mm-hmm. You come in here with another sexy independent chick. Oh, I have what, a collection. What's, what's going on here, man? Sexy this is how we go. Independent chick. Listen to me. A sexy uh, independent yeah. chick. It's just right past the ass. Hey, you don't. <laughs> He's not jealous, that's it. Jealous. <laughs> Jealousy. Pure jealousy. There has never been such a wide selection of shirts that celebrate the that's Bahamas. A, that's with a, with a V. With a V. V. Uh, with, uh, with a V. With a V. Why? And, um,. And you know, I think this is me. We'll talk about it at some point. But I think one of the really outstanding, well, just about everything was outstanding. But the Independent Secretariat, when they got this design done, mm-hmm. that could be put onto fabric, it could be put onto anywhere. It's a print. Um, it, right, a print. I just thought that that was a brilliant, brilliant move. I just think it's a beautiful shirt. Yeah. It looked better on me, too. Oh, well, please. You know, <laughs> this, 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 this triple X shakes the oh, chest. Man, give me a break. <laughs> <laughs> well, give me a break. You're saying that's an outside <laughs> Good morning, chairman. You know, well, good morning, well, morning chairman. You, I, I can tell you how your video is this morning. <laughs> <laughs> you're, full, you're full of life. Full of life. I'm the energy I'm ready, ready to go. Promise. I'm doing very well. We are happy to have you in studio with us, you know. Yeah, good, 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 good. Early. <laughs> Say what? <laughs> Just the person who came late? Yeah. You came yes. late, you talking about early? Once in a blue moon. More boys are never blue. <laughs> <laughs> you that's what right you there. That that's <laughs> what you know. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, anyway, before the before the show, we were, we were listening to that song. Uh, they Me made too. A bit <laughs> oh, 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 the, the graveyard in the graveyard in the the bottle and hanging in the tree. The bottle in the tree. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Gracious, we have to talk about yeah. that. What is this? What is it? What is it? All is red. But look, I have two shades blacker. And I'm a guy that see you better than since you see my last. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ronald That's Sims, you still take it, man. Yeah, I got it, take man. It was I'm rough. Take, it was rough. It, it was, was rough. a good show, Ronald. It was a good show. I thank you, sir. Yes. Very good yes. show. Very good Excellent. show. Excellent. You know, it amazes me how you can put on a seven-hour show. Yeah. That well, take a special type of talent. Well, once you got the elements, and uh, there's no shortage of talent in the yeah. country, and yeah. um, we were just able to to bring it all together. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, congratulations, my brother. Congratulations. True. Thank yeah. you. And uh, I, I share that <coughs> with, with, with uh, Fred, who was the actual producer, and Phil... Um, Phil Which Fred? Fred Ferguson. Okay. And, 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 and uh, Patrice Francis, who was the, nice. the writer of the, the show, and, nice. and Phil, Phil um, Burroughs, who was the director of the show, and... Uh, we all came together mm-hmm. and, and presented it to the Bahamian audience. Excellent. P- perhaps, perhaps, uh, if, 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 if our team agrees, we can have you guys on in studio to actually talk about how, how you, yeah. how you, behind how you the scenes, yeah. how, you, how you actually created it <coughs> like that. <coughs> because it takes, I'd imagine, a lot of um, coordination. Yeah. You know so I, I, mean? will, I, will, I will put it to the other members of the team and see if we can get them all in here for next Saturday. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, let me ask you this question as well. Who sings that song? They made a fool of me. 
That's dry bread. Yeah, yeah, that's dry bread. Yeah, the uh-huh. term dry bread Ferguson. So dry yeah. bread, see, take Another graveyard date. Put a bomb and hang it in the tree. tree. <laughs> oh, that's true. <laughs> and you know, the, 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 the thing about it is we don't see that anymore, but they had us dead fool back then. They had us so scared before I left here. Yeah. <laughs> we believe that, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the, the, the mango tree and the dilly tree and everything would be loaded. Oh, my. And don't you see that green bottle and that you don't dare go You don't around. touch it. You know what's up. But it's definitely to have you in, in studio again, my brother. We missed you last week. Absolutely. That's good to be back. Good so, to we gave you back. Some, so we gave you a little blag for not being here last week. I, I appreciate that. Mm. Yeah. I, 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 also had, I also had cataract surgery while I was off. Oh, all right. All right. So I, could, I could see a little better now. I can see you a little better now. Okay, know? good, good. Yeah. So everything went well. Yeah, it went very well. God is good. Really Modern God technology is, is amazing. Yeah. I have had cataract surgery on both eyes. Mm-hmm. And yeah, it's done in a couple of hours. And, and you are actually, well, they didn't put me to sleep. You are awake the whole time. So uh, that's why you could see, you, you could bask in my hands. Mom, please, man. <laughs> <laughs> I, please. I uh, congratulate <laughs> the doctor for being a phenomenal <laughs> talk. And, and, and that's right, she's right. It's considered minor surgery now. Yes. yes. Yeah. You went yeah. through the whole process. I was in and out of there. And I, I, think, I think that would freak exactly. me out. I it, think that would freak me Darren, out. Darren, it to was the weirdest thing. But you know, it, and yeah, we'll talk about that another time. But one of the hardest parts of that procedure procedure is anticipating it. Mm. You mm. cannot wrap your brain around somebody going into your eye. Right. That's right. Yeah. I think that have to put me yeah. have to put me on those. I'm Once like, they I, get started you don't feel a thing. And going in your eye while you wake you right, exactly eye, right? exactly oh. uh, amazing. But you feel absolutely nothing. I felt nothing. Mm. I, I was just there uh, listening while they were talking. Talking, that's right. Pass me this and give me that and yeah. the next thing. And yeah. yeah, that's right. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> that's all right. <laughs> the precious gift of sight. Yes. The two yes. gifts we open every morning, every morning. our eyes. Mm. And close every night. There you go. So who's, who's doing the prayer? Because it looked like you only want to pray this morning. <laughs> See, that's the problem. No sinners. Let's get started. <laughs> I made coming. And then throw it. And then throw it. And then throw it. Yes. You come late. We were sufferers. <laughs> we <were> sufferers. <laughs> Let us pray. Heavenly Father, for the gift of life, we give you thanks. Mm-hmm. For our nation, we pray for peace, prosperity, and principle, recovery, and restoration. And for ourselves, we pray for wisdom to use your gifts wisely, especially the gift of Junkanoo, so that we may honor you, serve your people, build better communities, a better Bahamas, and a better world. Amen. 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 Proud to be Bahamian. What we got this morning? Well, we're talking about that same, well, about the independence celebrations, mm-hmm. which I think overall were absolutely I phenomenal. Agree. I agree. Yeah, they did an outstanding job. Never on that scale, perhaps since 73, yeah. but uh, just the magnitude of what they attempted mm. and what they succeeded in in, in doing, uh, we are very proud. And, and, you know, hats off to Her Excellency, the second in command, uh, Mr. Thompson. So Jack. And, uh, Mr. Thompson, Mr. Jack Thompson, and the entire team, they really did an outstanding job. I totally job. agree. Yeah. Totally agree. Yeah. You, Farrington, you got any proud to be baby moments? No. Other than sitting next to me every side. Oh, please, you know. Lord. <laughs> <laughs> don't be shy, you know. No, no, don't be shy. Otherwise, then I can sit next to you next week. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I'm proud to be baby moment. Truly, is, it, it stands from that is I do get to learn from you both, um, Arlene and yourself, every Saturday. And for me, one of the, the a proud moment was this week was actually the People's Rush. Mm. There was a lot oh, of people yeah. that was we anticipating about that. the live stream yeah. mm. because they weren't in the country. Man. And it was a good feeling to know that John You were the only person who did it. Be able to provide that. Incredible. And we had a lot of people tuned in from all around the world. Uh, a lot of 
uh, different islands, even different countries. And yeah. it was it was a good feeling that, you yeah. know, to be among you guys, hey, I actually bring something to the table. What you did was, uh, it was a public service because the the prog- the um the show the um the parade right, was right. not broadcast anywhere else and and in real time uh <laughs> df did the entire the entire rush and and truly that is commendable glad to know you got permission to be out that hour of the morning and you know as we talk about proud to be behaving let me draw this big rock and one bottle. This a bo- this is uh, this a, a uh, little rock. This a pebble. Or, or, no, no, or this a boulder. boulder. What? Uh, yeah, yeah. I uh, am really proud. I am proud of the young people who decided to keep the tradition alive of Bahamian music. Mm. And I ask us to be more considerate. Some of us, when we are so quick to criticize our own mm. just the effort alone is commendable and on that note i will simply say that no he was not wrong nassau is the capital <laughs> of the bahamas say what? okay that that's, that. That. Yeah. That. that's that <laughs> that's that i mean there was a close <laughs> <button. laughs> what <laughs> There was a big debate about whether or not Nassau is the capital. You're joking. Darren Bastianus, I sit here. Somebody put on Facebook that he was wrong, that Nassau is not the so capital. Who, 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 what did they have as the capital? I, they- I imagine New Providence. Oh. The whole, the entire <laughs> they island. St. John's. Uh, apparently. <laughs> But we'll leave wow. that right there. But wow. but I want to congratulate that young man. I just absolutely love it. And Nassau is oh yeah, t- t- listen. And to Nassau me, listen. is listen the to capital. Me. Listen, <laughs> listen. And I think it, the whole thing started as a joke, right? And then everybody just caught it. The on police band play it. All the jungle play it. Um, I just love it. It's catchy. Yeah. Yes, yes. You know, I don't want to. I don't want to um, um, describe the winning song because I don't know what the winning song is. Me either. Anybody know what the winning song is? Right. <laughs> That's some pressure because yeah. you don't know the winning song is, but you know the song yeah, called the public's you know. attention. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And and uh, and uh, I just thought I just congratulate him on that. You know, when the big debate came up and somebody sent me a WhatsApp asking what is the correct thing because they are in the a big debate with somebody about about this thing and you know my thing is London is the capital of Great Britain okay of, of England um, Paris is the capital of France a capital is a city so even though as was pointed out to me a lot of the confusion comes in because when our ministry of tourism markets the bahamas they market nassau as an island they and don't say the come to new it. providence come to, come to the city right come to words. exuma come to abaco they say come to nassau exuma right. grand bahama abaco so they label nassau almost as the whole island, the whole island and right. that may be where the confusion came in and certainly the city of nassau the, is beginning to blend into other settlements but you but you know grandstown adelaide the yes. um 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 all of these places are settlements on this island and the capital city is nassau Nassau. yeah when you write nassau like when this is how i was taught in school if you are addressing uh, uh, a letter or whatever it's nassau your providence capital n full stop capital p full stop Bahamas. Yes. Arlene, hey. let, tell our listeners, please, because many do not know, <coughs> what is the geographical boundary of Nassau? 
Now, Ronald, you know, in recent years, it has been more of a political thing in terms of where the constituency boundaries are. Oh, I'm but talking about no constituency. I can <laughs> speak. <laughs> I can <laughs> <laughs> speak. I can speak. I can speak. No, 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 no because I can, because I'm, I'm getting ready to give you the boundaries. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. From the loyalist period so uh -huh. i had to qualify that because i'm going back to the late 1770s but, Let's go in back. Okay. But, All right. but, but it has not changed okay so <laughs> these are the boundaries of the town of nassau the northern boundary is the harbor right and that's why nassau became the capital because we have the best harbor all the traffic was by water Okay, and so having the best harbor, as a long story, Paradise Island helps to make our harbor sheltered, so, that kind of mm, thing, right? Mm. Okay, <clears throat> so the northern boundary is the harbor. The western boundary is West Street. The West Street. In the old days, West Street came straight down out to the water where the where the the um point is now right mm -hmm. you know you you with me yeah i got you I know the it. eastern boundary is east street mm -hmm. which still runs out to the harbor right. right okay and the southern boundary was the hill street the town of nassau came right up the Where's hill the street the ridge where that government house sits on mm -hmm. That's the hill. That's kind of like West Hill Street there. So when Governor Fitzwilliam built Government House and put it in the center of the Hill Street, mm -hmm. it became West Hill Street mm -hmm. and East Hill Street. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You with me? Yeah, I got you. So those are the boundaries of old Nassau. And the African townships, Delancey Town was the first one, Grantstown, then Bain Town, grew up around the, the town of old Nassau. Right. right. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. That's the best I could do right See, now. See, that's why we send you to school. <laughs> <laughs> that's what my grandmother used to say. <laughs> that's why we send them to school. Very good, very yeah. good, very yeah. good. So very there good. we have it. Yeah. Good, so, so yeah, Nassau is the capital. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't realize there was a doubt about that. Oh yeah, you know, but you know, <clears throat> big, big wow. And you know, the, the interesting thing about that too is, I guess, because people are now in this had this debate about whether Nassau is the capital. If you listen to the lyrics of the song, he mm -hmm. also um, does a lot more, a lot more education as well. Yes. He says, Bimini is the gateway." Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, it's very catchy. Absolutely. Very yeah. catchy. I think people have to get beyond the view that they live in Nassau. They don't live in Nassau. Yeah. You know, you live in South Beach, you live in Nassau. Sure, you know right. far you mm. live in Nassau? That's right. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you, you live in New Providence right. and that's it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, folks, since they didn't start the show, we beat the show. We got a different time for the show. We're going to officially introduce you to the show after we take this break. We'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> From the Junkanoo archives on the Junkanoo timeline, the year was 2023. In the early hours of July 10th, the people of Bahamas continued the independence celebration with a spectacular 22nd annual Independence People's Love and Unity Rush on <coughs> British Street. Prior to the rush, 11 participating Junkanoo groups were honored by the Junkanoo Development Association, as well as the JCNP and the independent secretary. It was a spectacular display of national pride with thousands of proud Bahamians on hand to join in. Another proud notch on the Junkanoo timeline. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. You listen to Junkanoo 242, and I mean, <coughs> this show started, we started talking about the boundary um, the, uh, the the boundary of the city of Nassau, Nassau yeah. and we had um, a well. Uh, uh, how would you how would you describe this young lady? Um, a highly distinguished barrister. A highly distinguished yes. barrister. Attorney okay. at law. Oh, at law. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. You yes. yes. saw the 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 the. the, the attention to pronunciation right there yes because that she demands that <laughs> she, she she requires that a woman of her stature <sighs> absolutely <laughs> so this is what she sent now uh -huh. we we would like to know see if we can find out what 
law this is, but she is sending us. This is entitled Boundaries of the City of Nassau. Mm -hmm. All that part, all that part uh -huh. of New Providence bounded on the north by the harbor of Nassau, mm -hmm. on the east by Mackey Street, on the south by an imaginary line starting at a point approximately 380 yards to the south of the junction of Mackey Street and Shirley Street and continuing in a straight line to the southeast corner of the grounds of the Princess Margaret Hospital. Thence southwesterly to Prison Lane, thence to the division wall between the barracks and the prison, <laughs> thence in a straight line westwardly to the junction of Dillett Street and Blue Hill Road and following the center of Dillett Street and Meeting Street to Nassau Street and on the west by Nassau Street. The city of Nassau shall also include the whole of Paradise Island, also Porter's Key, and all other islets and keys in the harbor of Nassau. There, there you, you have it. it. All right. What's the, what's the date of that? What's the date? <coughs> Is that dated? Uh, Darren, uh, see if you can find out uh, what's I the name the of the it says. Service 2001. It, I think it's from the law. Yes. Well, the Bahamas. Somewhere. Mm, yeah. That's why I sit next to you. You know people. Right. Yeah, he know uh, people. That's, that's, why why next next you. <coughs> that's why I told you. That's what I told you. Thank you, madam. We appreciate that update very, very much. Who's the person that said that to us? Are we at liberty to say? I think we at liberty to say. Well, you know, Mr. Bahamas is going to say 50. Your mouth is hanging on live wire. <laughs> We want to say thank you to Tonya Bastian Galanis. Oh. We are very, oh. very oh. grateful, madam. What was that there? The focus is on the Bastian. Well done, girls. Well done. Yes, most distinguished. We won't say what school she went to. Oh, so no, 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 we ain't going to say No, we ain't going to say talk some and keep <laughs> some. Yeah, you can keep that one in our pocket. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the word of people from the other place will harden up the yes. head and then we'll then we put, we pull that and put it on the table. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, truly. You're trying to throw a rock now. I'm going out. We throw a bonus back. Ladies and gentlemen, Lord, it's all down. I just want to show you what the odds it is. We have such a distinguished guest in the e shock. We carrying on like we have no guests, man. No guests there? No guests. And look at this distinguished gentleman. He's sitting here so patiently with all his manner showing. Because he refused to interrupt and say, you know, forget me. <laughs> <laughs> we are talking this morning. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh -huh. Ladies and gentlemen, we are looking back at independence. Mm -hmm. And when we say looking back, we mean looking back. We are going back to 1973. We are going back as recently as Monday morning gone. And we are very honored to have in the e -shack with us this morning, none other than the legend, Mr. Constello Cosi Fernando. If you don't know that name and you think you in junk, I don't think you here. <laughs> so, Uncle Cos, good morning. Morning, morning, Mom. It's, it's a joy, it's a pleasure to be here with you all on this Saturday morning. It is wonderful to have you here and thank you so much for coming. Wouldn't have missed it for nothing in the world. All right, I'll be off and running. So, Darren Bastian, get us started and we'll all jump right in, Uncle Cos. So, Cosy, well. <coughs> Big brother Cozy. Mm -hmm. So tell us, let's start, like we always say on the show, let's start at the very beginning. Right. Tell us about your history in John Canoe. How is it that you got into John Canoe? Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. I had two, actually three cousins. Two rushed for the Saxons, one rushed for Pepsi Gold, and then the Wally Boys. Mm -hmm. um, <coughs> my older cousin, Joe the Merritt, 
I don't know if you remember this. Miss Wiggs might know what I'm talking about. The classics back in the day. Oh, yeah. In Miami. Yes. My cousins used to participate in that. And that's actually how I learned. To, well, actually, I learned the place on cardboard. I learned the place on, on, on anything, man. But, like I said, my cousins, <coughs> Larry and... and well, he was just here. I went back to Kentucky this this. I saw him on the parade. Oh, yes. Okay. Oh. He, he's, he's, he's at the at the, the Love and Unity Rush. Okay. Yes. 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 We spoke yes. in the square. Like I, like I said, Eddie Ford might like to think he started me out in Georgia. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Morning, Eddie. <laughs> actually, my two my three cousins. Like I said, one two with the Saxons and. One with Wally Boy. Uh, now, not cutting you off. When, when the name was called, I think Laddie called the name of a demerit involved in Junkanoo in Foxhill, and my mind went right on you. Uh, is that a relation yes, yes, as well? Yes. Okay. Yes. Gotcha. Yes, like I, like I said, um, well, one thing Eddie was actually responsible for is introducing me to Gus Cooper, mm. which mm. was my, my teacher. Mm -hmm. I was like, um, Gus cut out boy. Mm. You know, mm -hmm. when we wore the costumes, I would cut them out. And at a young age, I I think I was the only one who could go in all in Wally Boy Shark because back in the day, you couldn't dare go in nobody's shark. Right. Wow. But it's still that. It's still Even that, if you were in the same group. Yes, it's still that today like that. It, it's still like that. Wow. But like I said, I got to see all of the costumes, and I'm so, so amazed to see all of these things at, at a young boy, mind you. Mm -hmm. What do you call a young boy? That's about what? 15, 16, somewhere mm. around there. Okay. Mm -hmm. And like I said, um, um, I can't leave a doll, but he actually was another teacher because I learned to to do all of the, the building from him. Because mm. he used to actually build, a uh, would draw, and he would do all of the framework for the costumes. Mm. And I, I've learned so much so from... Such a young engineer. Mm. Yes. From Doyle Boss and e even Peter Turing Quest. Well, I saw him with folks. You don't know what it meant to me seeing those people on Independence Day. Because 50 years ago, I never thought I would be here. Mm -hmm. and, and to see them and, and add my feet, that, that was the thing. <laughs> <laughs> and add don't miss a lap. Oh, man. That, it, it was so much joy for me to see all of that. I, I couldn't tell you what I was feeling. Mm -hmm. During that during the rush on, on Monday morning, I know the feeling. Yes, to see everybody out there in fly colors. But they were all out there. You know, yes. They mentioned. Yes, yes. I, I just thank God for being involved because I think that'll be one of our greatest achievements when the story of our lives are written. Is that same Independence okay. People's Rush? I mean, that look like boxing day. Okay, sure. I really sure brought a copy of me and Robert Ferguson carrying the bottle. That thing's in the papers. So I gotta no! <laughs> hey, where's the camera? <laughs> I gotta see that. Yeah. Ronald Sims, we talking some serious history in here. Let me see it. Uh, you know, you, you and Cozy have to educate them two young fellas at the table. There you know. <laughs> like, I, mean, I can accept that. I can, I can accept that. Uh, 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 they, they need Ronald. plenty schooling. Yeah. Ronald, listen here. With all that gray in this pair, that's a compliment you calling him young. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess. So, Uncle Carl, so now you got involved through your cousins. Yes. And you had a cousin, you had two cousins rushing for the Saxons yes. and one rushing for the Valley Boys. Yes. So now, before this, you had been living on Elutra or you were in Nassau no, the whole time? Nassau, I was in Nassau so, the whole time. Okay. And so you then, tell us what caused you to go with the Valley and not with the Saxons. I, I, to, to tell you the truth, Miss Ferguson, I came out of the area of the Saxons, but I, I never, never rushed for the Saxons. Wow. I, to tell you the truth, what, what draw me to the Wally boys was people like Dougie, Gummy, Peter, those, those guys, they, they, they were great. They were great guys. What I, what I, to tell you the truth, what I like about the Saxons, the Saxons, Always had color. Yeah. They always had color. Right. But I, I never rushed for them. Yeah. You were just drawn to the Valley yeah. Boys. And I'll tell you a little, a little secret. Bubbles was never supposed to rush for the Saxons. Is that right? Yes. You know how Bubbles got to the Saxons? 
Actually, when he came around the wally boy, he shot me and run it because they say he comes to smile. Oh. <laughs> you see how God works? You see that? <laughs> <laughs> the rest, as they say, is history. Yeah, but it, it turned out well. It turned out well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so, now we are, <clears throat> you, we are approaching 1973. And you have been in the Valley Boys for how long? Actually, by I've been on the Valley Boys from the early 60s, but I've never rushed. Okay. I was always <clears throat> pasting or doing something, but I, never, I started to rush in 1971. Mm -hmm. My first year rushing. Mm -hmm. But, um, like I... Doing what? Back line or front line? Actually, this, let me let me take you through the steps, Miss Miss Ferguson. Mm -hmm. We, uh, you know, it's so amazing. Let me put it like that today. That anybody could jump up and say, "Man, I going to the front line." Mm -hmm. You have to earn your spot in that sure. front line. Amen. I started out as a bellow, then I came up as a as a dancer, and then I I became. Uh, then I got into the big costume. God would never ever put you in that front line. Without going through those steps. Wow. And to me, it's, it's, it's so amazing that anybody could go in the front line. No. Yeah. But you had to earn that. Mm -hmm. And I, Gus was a fellow that, I mean, he, 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 he didn't know what he wanted. He was a person, I mean, he, he could pitch a talent, I mean. <laughs> Gus was a great man. Wow. Great and man. so, what I remember, and I think this might have been the 70s. The biggest competition on Bay Street was in the valley, was in the valley in, in the itself. Valley, yes. And there were, tell me if I'm wrong, there were three big dogs in the front, big horses in the front. And all, I never even, I could remember when you came to one family and they said, Corsi, and I said, this ain't the Corsi, the legend, because I had never known you, but I knew your name. And so in, in, in the valley, it was... Dougie, it was Gummy, and it was Cozzy. <laughs> now, I that's all right, it's, right? Yes, it's, it's couple more. Mm -hmm. Peter and Chris. Um, Peter used to carry a lead piece, too? Yes, yes. Okay. Yes, there's, there's many other people, but I, I can't remember them. Day the like three, that. I remember. But I, I've, I've learned some things from Dougie and Gummy. Mm -hmm. I actually built Dougie, um, Gummy costume for the first independence. Uh -huh. as, as a young boy, mind you, I, mm -hmm. like I said, me and Robert Ferguson, we we paced on every every B costume the while he took that that year, especially Dougie's costume. Is that right? Yeah, the flower garden, we, we did a lot of pacing on that. And of course, the Dougie we are talking about is none other than Paul Major, Paul Major. who is a, this was a distinguished banker yes. in his professional career. Yes. Yeah. And in the Junkanoo world, he was studying. Legend, yes. Um, it's a big dog. Yes. Mm -hmm. well, I thought that we, we had the opportunity to travel a couple, couple months ago. And we nice. And talk. nice, 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 nice. Yes, yes. And so, you moved up through the ranks. Yes. And you ended up carrying a lead piece yes. with the Valley Boys. Now, in those days... There were no wheels. No. No, lead piece was mm -hmm. a costume that yes. you danced. Yes. Okay. That's describe, the describe, if, you, if you had to, in terms of size, right? If, if you had to look at a lead costume in 1973, mm -hmm. what size costume would that be in our current parade? Mm. Well, actually, the, the, the costumes are almost, the lead costumes that the Wally Boys took in 1970 is almost basically the same size of what would be Gary now. Mm, okay. Wow. I'll, I'll never forget. Um, I know you remember in the Gods and Demons. <laughs> 1972. Uh -huh. they, they actually the Saxons. Changed, yes, they changed John Canoe. Um, God said, you know what, they'll never get me back like that again. And... and that's how come we, we are so huge. That so the size exploded after yes. Hindu gods yes. and demons. Yes. I got to put that on the timeline. Yes. yes, I saw those fellas cutting paper about what? June, before July. And, and this was probably around April. They, they were cutting paper. They were cutting this, <laughs> this early when they must be going on. Preparing for a show or something, but not knowing that. But they, they, at the the Saxons. Yes. 
because they were that huge. They had a shack on West Hill Street, right on Hospital Lane corner. They were in that building. Okay. And um, some of that was done in there. Okay, I also have to give a shout out to, to Red Down, who oh. I always talk to <laughs> on occasionally. And like I, I asked him the other day when I saw him, Down, what you was doing? Leading up there in the building, tell me, yeah. boy, I was getting leave. <laughs> <laughs> But Dowell is a true friend, and not only that, he was the first person that ever wore the best costume during, during, I mean, leading up right up to, to now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and he listens to the show every every Saturday morning, too. No. Morning, Dowell. Morning, Red. Yeah. Oh, we, 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 we would be honored to have you as our guest one Saturday oh, morning. He, 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 he got, got a story to tell. He got a lot of stories to tell. Wow. Oh. I remember when Dowell, you know, at Christmas time when everybody come out from college, you know, Bayshree used to be the thing, and Dowell used to be downtown cutting papers like me. <laughs> <laughs> but it was a fun time, man. It was a fun time. And not only that, Dowell, he was the kind of person that I don't think he even remembered this. My first year, 1971, I got a little trick of, um, I got a little puzzled with my colors, and, and he stepped in, although I was rushing for the water, he was rushing for the socks, and he, he showed me what, what colors to use, mm-hmm. and to me, that's the spirit of jungle, yes. when, when you could help somebody, yes. who, regardless of the yeah, group, yeah. and to me, I, I feel the same way right now, I mean, anybody could come and, and, and ask me, I, one thing you don't ever try to do, Ms. Forex, is hi. What you know from people. Your gift. You don't do that. Yeah. No, you don't do that. You yeah. help them as much as you possibly could. There you go. Yeah, that's 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 a profound statement. And I think it was last week when, when Jimmy Palacios made a similar comment that okay. we have a responsibility to share. Yes. And, uh, you know, for those who don't know, and that is so important. Yeah, because you, you, you cannot carry this information. That's right. Business, but That's so right. you have to share it? You have to share it, absolutely. You have to share it. And so, and you know, the thing about it is that would make an interesting show, but a, but a lot of times we don't talk it because okay. even in Junkano today, mm-hmm. There's a lot of sharing and swapping uh-huh. between uh-huh. groups, yes. you know, and because we all re- we all realize that if one group is not on Bay Street, our circle is broken. Yes. We want everybody there, you know. It's not just our, it, it wouldn't make any sense if only us there. We want everybody there, and when people ask for help, we jump in. Mind, mind you, it wasn't always that way. Our no. fellas could see you getting leave. <laughs> you could get leave. <laughs> yeah, but like I said, I'm glad to see that. I mean, it, it's changing. Yes. Like I can remember back in the day, if you was a Wally boy and I was a Saxon, I, we, would, we wouldn't even speak. We wouldn't have, we wouldn't have a conversation. Just because you're rushing for the Wally and I'm rushing for the Saxon, you we didn't have a conversation. <laughs> wow. <laughs> but it's you very blame, tribal. You know who I blame for that? I, I blame the leaders for that. I because was just getting ever, ready to ask that very question. They, if you think never, that's a that's reflection of never, the leaders. Never, ever. Mm. Address it. Mm. I, I, no, I, not they, just address it. Mm-hmm. Wow. They, they said new example. I'm I glad as they got older. Yeah. They, they got over that, that, that old way of thinking. Things started to change. Right. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, um, but let's talk about that when we come back from the break. Folks, we're running to our, another break. Once we get back, we're going to jump right back into the conversation. You're tuning in to Jump 242. We'll be right back. Files under F for funerals. One family playing of the song Crazy Boyo on Independence One and brought back memories, many memories of Ken Boyer Davis. So great a Junkanoo personality that in 2012, the Junkanoo community turned out in large numbers to rush him to his final resting place in the Western Cemetery. A tourist remarked that it seemed to be a celebration and indeed it was. In the African tradition, slave funerals in the Bahamas were huge celebration in which family and friends gathered and after a short sermon, the long procession passed in the gra- in the front of the grave. Afterwards, there would be a huge feast. The slaves <coughs> would get together and eat, drink, dance, and play drums throughout the night in celebration of the life of the deceased. 
Jankano Funerals, our proud tradition continues. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. You're listening to Jankano 242, and we are having a fascinating conversation with Uncle Kozi Kozi Fernando. Um, he's telling us about his history in Jankano, and he's telling us, and we're going down memory lane from 1973 straight up to 2023. Because as we as we went to the book, we were talking about some of the some of the tension that was between some of the bigger groups or some of the the only <coughs> that was around or are most notable in terms of leadership uh, fostering that type of attitude. What would you think would be one of the reasons as to say that it has changed over time? Um, well, the the, the 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 new group groups probably forced um, change a lot of things because, like I said, back in the day. The two old groups, which is the Wally boys and the Saxons, we, if you rushing for the Wally and I rushing for the Saxons, we wouldn't even speak to one another. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of us. And, and, and I, like I, I blame the group leaders for that because they never used to associate with one another. Mm-hmm. If I can't say some of the words that are on there that, that they used to tell one another when, when they saw one another. Mm-hmm. But I, I'm so glad it, it, it changed from that that it's it's much more than that now. I mean, because I have friends in just about every group in in this island, and I mean, they don't matter what group I mean. With wise words, because like I said, and that's how it should be. Yes, mm-hmm. because um, like I said, we Jonkano should be, it should be much more than just going down Bay Street. And, and to me, Jonkano is in the shop. Mm. It's in the shock, man. When you could get together with, with your boys every day and talk old stories. That's man. the best That's part the of John Cole right there. there. Yes, I agree. I remember some nights. Uh, we never used to actually start work after 12 o'clock. I fell sitting on the side of you over there. He <laughs> would sneak around sometimes just to see what we was doing. My <laughs> Lord. <laughs> we never used to do anything <laughs> today. Yeah, when, when the shock was full, we never did anything. We would do little, little, little stuff with our work never start, <laughs> not until after 12 o'clock. This is actually in, in one family. Now. I, I've never even got to the story that how I got to one family. <laughs> yeah, so let's talk about that. Well, actually, I was partly retired. I, mean, I used to go in the shop from time to time just to sit down with Ricky and Bubbles. And so hold on now. Let's, let's set the stage for persons who do not know. You had stopped rushing for the valley. Yes. And you and your brother, your younger brother, oh. Bubbles, Trevor Bubbles to Costa, had left the Saxons yes. and gone with one family. Yes. Okay. So, okay. So you were not involved with the Valley Boys and Bubbles was deeply involved in one family. Yes. Uh-huh. So, I, like I said, I used to go in the shack and just sit down and watch them. And I, I said to myself, you know something? Get a mic. My brother is actually working hard. He's building. Truly. He's drawing on costume. He's coloring. He's doing all of those things. Mm-hmm. And I said, you know, something. I I can help him a little bit, you know, because I mean, I I can also do all of those things too. But <laughs> it never really took off. Not until actually I started to do some work with him back in in the Saxons. But you know, it was nothing much. I actually started with with space. Mm-hmm. I did a little, little bit of drawing in space, and and uh, I don't know if it was the following year, Angel Morning, that I I drew for, I drew for just just six box shot, Angel Morning. I I just draw for the shot, but in 1999, oh, that's, that's when I fly. That's Africa, Africa. Africa. yes. Hey, that, hey, that, that, cradle of civilization. Yeah, I, I, I was on the plane. Like oh, so oh, you got to do boss man with Bill. You ain't got to worry about nothing else. Nothing else, yeah. Bill. Mm. Uh, to tell you the truth, Miss Floyd, I don't think it was a, be- uh, a better one-two punch than me and my brother. Shine the light. Truly, truly, truly. We were doing really some things. And let, me, let me tell you why I'm saying that. Mm-hmm. Bubbles came from the Saxons. Yes. I came from the Wally Boys. Yes. If the Saxons was doing anything, Bubba saw that before. Yeah. If the Wally Boys doing anything, I saw that before. I was yes. back in the day. Them fellas <laughs> didn't change too much, so we could have punched them right now. 
<laughs> Fuck with Fluggy. You all had him to play. Yes, yes. Space, 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 but, but, but Uncle Cos, that may be true. Space would have been 96. Yeah. Alien invasion. Right, 96. Um, What did I say? 98. Oh, sorry. No, 98 was Angels. Yes, 98 was um, Angels. Um, um, do not for one minute sell yourself short in terms of you and Bubbles' ability. Mm -hmm. Many people would have seen what you saw, but would not have I've been able to do what you all did. Don't do okay. not sell yourself short. You all were, you are nothing short of genius when it comes to Junkanoo, when it comes to interpreting a theme, and when it comes to execution. Don't sell yourself short. It and and I have never seen in my limited experience with designers and builders, the depth of the research that Bubbles used to do. Okay. Man, this was a no superficial thing. He went deep into research, and that really impressed me. Well, really, I, I have to include my mom in this too. Miss Susie. Really, when we were doing <clears throat> anything from the Bible, yes. my mom would always tell him, you, know, you got to do it right. So yes. She used to stand me yes. when we searched too. Yes, yes. Well, like I said, my mom used to do a lot of things behind the scene. Um, she was the let backbone. Just, let me just say this. <coughs> During leading up to Christmas, when we all would get sick, bush my, my lady would, 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 oh. would go get the bush meal. Oh, she, she was a, she was a specialist, <laughs> and she bring it over to the shack and believe it. If you were there, <laughs> you was going to get catching that. She dosing up the entire shack. Because we were working so hard, oh, everybody yeah. would come down with the flu. Man. You know who does that, Rory? Okay. At the beginning of the season. Come September or whenever it is, they start. Oh. Rory is coming with the with the Cerasi. You have to. And you have to. Man. I try to duck. <laughs> <laughs> and in self defense. Stay in the house. Stay in the house. But 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 yes, to get everybody's energy up, yes. and 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 to me that was such a beautiful Bahamian twist to a Bahamian experience. My, my mother knew a lot of Bushmen. Oh but yeah, but none of us picked it. I should have recorded her. Man, none she was an expert. Up. Yeah, she was an expert, Miss Susie. We love you, Miss Susie. <laughs> and she uh, and she not to introduce too much sadness, but. She died a few days after bubbles. Yes, just after. couldn't take it. She wow. was gone. Yeah, you know, that that was a bubbles was a baby. Yes, child, that was it. That was it. That was the time. Anyhow, we thank God for the memory, yes. and we know where they are. Yes, and so it's a it's it's still a cause for 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 celebration. But let me go back to something you said earlier, which I find really really interesting. When it comes to coloring. Mm. Few people have, I think it's genius, for, to be able to look at a piece of cardboard that's painted white. Uh. And some, and y'all could put the lines in, and then y'all could see in your mind. Finished. What color, right. Finished. You could yeah. see it finished, and, and you got the nerve to say that you, where did you say something about color and you didn't know how to color? What did you say earlier? I, 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 I really said I didn't know how to color before I could put it down now. Boy, you forget about the cause. Those colors are jumping off those I, costumes. But Miss Friends, I, I think that's a gift from God because yeah. let me let me tell you what the reason why I say that. I could see a costume color just 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 in brown. Mm. I, I, I could see the colors. Yeah. And like I said, that that's that's a gift. That's a gift. Yeah, it it's a gift and, and Going back to, to bubbles, it ain't too much people gonna beat him. He could, he could color. I mean, he could take anything and, and, and make it work. So it's yellow. Yeah. Ali, when you speak about color, for me, what's genius in that is that not only is you guys can see the complete piece, you guys color a costume based <coughs> on what you want to highlight. And what I mean by that is this: for instance, if you bring in Africa 
Uh-huh. You know how to color it so it, it gives you a dark feel. Well, first, first of all, let me, let me just say this. It, it depends on what theme you're Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, the coloring is yes. dictated by the theme. Uh-huh. And that is why, and that is why also, um, Junkanoo groups try to choose their themes uh-huh. as early as they can because the theme will dictate colors. the colors the uh, the colors of the crepe paper that you are ordering yes. which takes about four yeah. months to get here from europe so you got to start yes. early yes. and so the planning is even before the costume is built okay i i don't i don't i, I know you remember when when roots took africa <laughs> yes they, they say it was better than our, our never film. see it no if so, the you know, colors you, were lighter yeah, you, that's that's what that's what yeah. i'm about to say right that's that's yeah. what they going wrong yeah the it's, colors it's, were light was not light i remember that the colors okay. the colors were the colors were quite light I was kind of taken pink, aback pink, um, pink uh, a lot of pink yeah but now to use let me tell you about the pink when it, Africa has been on Bay Street several times many times uh, <laughs> at least a hundred and counting but you see now that's what starts. I get ready to say uncle cause there was a morning when the Valley Boys brought, I think it was Happy, Happy, or Watusi. Watusi. Listen here, I have this, yeah, I have this memory, Ronald Sims, I have this memory in my mind. Let me tell you, the parade used to come out of Frederick Street and turn on to be. And Gus Cooper walked down to Bay Street and just stood in the middle of the road waiting for the rest of the group to come. And in my mind, I remember seeing the black and white black of and the white. zebra stripe, um, striping, but there was a pink. Mm. That he splashed pink somewhere and David was on his shield Probably or shield. wherever it was. And let me tell you, that contrast was stunning. And so when you talk about pink, mm-hmm. it's how you use it yes. and how much of it you use. It's a highlight color. Yes. Well, I mean, that, me and Robert used to paint Scott's costume back in the day. Wow. <laughs> you know what I mean? like, yeah, yeah. But like you said, it's like that. Let me, let me talk about that hot pink with what Silver used to get. You, you know, we only splash that. Yes. We only use that like on borders. <clears throat> I like we don't, we don't go on to the costume with that. that. Gotcha, gotcha. And then with that, um, <coughs> what, 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 what do we call that? That, that purple. It's um, it, it's it, yes, it's a, it's a royal, it ain't a royal purple. Oh, yeah, mommy purple. used to call it the Elks purple. Yeah. Everybody was trying to get down on that purple. <laughs> yeah, it's like a, yeah. it's like a electric purple of some sort. It, yeah. it I, 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 I want my family people to know that we used to use actually. Close to 15 colors. Yeah. The baby bird and six. I told you was more than 15, yeah. <laughs> so good, so good. You saw it must be about three or four different color shades yeah. of pink. Yes. You got different colors. Three yes. or four different colors of shades of, of just about everything. The good old days. It was a one, a one but four or five shades of blue. From the light blue, the baby blue, the oh aqua, the deep blue. It would always be so funny. Mm-hmm. Because even when you choose, when you be choosing colors, that's a secret. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, remember now, the Junkanoo intrigue used to go deep because when the paper come <laughs> or when you order your secret weapon, <laughs> whatever that is, you don't want nobody from that. another group awakening in customs or anywhere else to see what you order. Boy, listen there, people don't know half of the drama used to go on. It was fun, man. Yeah, it was fun. It was fun. Folks, <laughs> Quick as that, we're running to another break. <laughs> when we get back, we're going to pick up this, this, this conversation because we got to talk about lines when we get back on the next side of this break. You're tuning in to Jump in the 242. We'll be right back. Examples of excellence. Cecil Thomas Jolly, known to the Junkanoo world simply oh. as Jolly, began designing Junkanoo costumes under the mentorship of Mr. John Chipman, and eventually he went on his own. Jolly was a very quiet and hard-working individual whose competence in the art of designing and pasting led to him being contracted to develop and sometimes fine-tune designs for various major Junkanoo groups. 
He was also sought after by many individuals to design and paste their individual costumes. His most notable pieces included Stay Alive in 95 <laughs> and Stay in the Gate in 98. <laughs> Mr. Jolly died on August 24, 1998. Tom Jolly, gone but not forgotten. This week's posthumous inductee into the Junkanoo 242 Shack of excellence. Stay alive and magnify. Charlie was a force. Yeah, I, I had the opportunity to go up against Tom Jolly when I was in the, the individual line. Mm -hmm. And not, not only that, I have a picture of Tom Jolly back in the. That probably was about 68 or 60. Probably 68. When he took. When the Saxons took African jungle, I think he took. He had. He had mm -hmm. The elephant, of, if I'm not mistaken, but I, I have a picture of, of Tom. Yeah, he's he is a legend, and we don't want to forget any yes. of them. So, Cosy, on the break, we started to talk about <coughs> the level of artistry that you were able to put in on some of the <coughs> costumes that 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 were produced. You want to talk about that? Yeah, let me let me just say this. Before I get into that, it's, it's so disappointing to see what's going on with, with John Canoe today that all you're getting is, is, is border and solid. Uh, it's like the artwork is going out the door. Mm. It, it went out the door. Um, but back in the so hold on. Before don't leave that, that's a, that's a big point. <laughs> you got to start. So, yeah. yeah. I was going to get into that. Later. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We, 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 need to, we need to understand... What that means? Are you seeing less lines yes. on the costumes? Yes. Well, first of all, they find what lines are, are because a lot of people may not necessarily understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah we're talking junk and shock talk so this morning. Let me refer to lines on a costume. You're talking about how a costume is drawn out. Yes, yes, right? the, the, the artistry. The, right, right. The right? artwork that's put on the cardboard that 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 will dictate where the colors go yes. exactly. and, and tell the story. Exactly. Yeah. So now when we say border and solids, we're only talking about... Yeah, you only, you only draw the, the, only the, the border and, and, and whatever whatever you, you want to do, because like I say, though, you don't have any artwork. Exactly. So, and really, in this dispensation of jungle right now, border and solids and decorations in the middle, and that's all you got. Yeah, that's all you got. No, there's no artistry. No, none whatsoever. So let's go back to the work you would normally have done. Let's talk about the level of artistry and the type of lines and what that means and how that looks on Bay Street. Well, actually, I would, with, 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 with a well-drawn costume, you don't even have to decorate like that. You don't have to decorate... Because the lines are going to say... Tell the day. story. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Today, the fellas, well, it ain't no lines to cover up. No way. They just, they just throw decorations on and, 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 and call it that. But I remember um, during, that was 1999, Happy Africa. Mm -hmm. A fella actually got sick from the lines that I was putting on his first <laughs> Oh, that was African equivalent civilization. Yes, and I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't be afraid to say his name. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, I, I made. Morning, I, I made. Great Mount Marlon Island. Great Mount Marlon Island. Yes. Right, that boy is like, I'm going to drink. But I, I, the greatest honor I, I could ever, I mean, was from, from Stan. And he, he probably, well, he, Stan used to mark on all the one time because he was yes. like that. And yeah. He turned the That's another line. Yes, Man, yes, we got yes, some serious lines, lines from now. Yes, Morning, yes, Uncle Stan. It was a pleasure to actually, I mean, no, I had that much faith in me that I, I, I could carry on. But a, a lot of people don't want to draw three quarters of one part of the Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Girls, brass, you name it, I used to draw it. Back line. And I, I just tried to find it for six parts. We did everything in one family. You can't mention one family without mentioning six parts. Absolutely. Because so. the only thing we didn't do was big costume. Anything mm. other than that? The banners, off the shoulders. Yes, you name it. Lion costumes. And it was fun. It was fun because we had a group of fellas love to do what they do. 
And we, we didn't have egos. We, we just go and do what we got to do. Do you, do you think that we're seeing that lack of artistry based on, <coughs> I guess, laziness? or I think it's, <laughs> and laziness has a lot to do with it. Because we, we live in the, in the day that it's microwave junk loop, in and out. That's, that's what it is. Because a fella could, he don't worry about pacing of our shoe. He just go, go to the shop, get some paper, slap that on and... Decorate you to death. And, and that's that. And he call that, he call that jungle, but I don't call that jungle. No, that, that's garbage. And <laughs> I, I just, no, 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 like, I, I, and, I, and, and forgive how I'm going to say this, Uncle God, because I was just in a conversation, I think it was yesterday or the day before yesterday with, with somebody, and I said, and I said, I said to them for a while I'd gotten really discouraged with John Kuno and he said why? I said because it has gotten nasty and it's gotten <coughs> lazy. Right? Lazy, yeah. Because and going back to something you said, we took pride in producing yes. a, a particular types of costume. Yes. Costumes. And when you were in a shack with I don't know, twenty, thirty guys producing these costumes, big man, you don't want to be at the bottom of the scale. Yes. <laughs> right? Because you will get a raggy in that shack. <laughs> you will get raggy, right? And uh, but everybody held that standard. Yeah. Everybody. We can't say we can't say, but we had a picky costume come out of that shack. That ain't gang. No. And That's before you get for the and before you get to come to that shack, but you gotta know what you could do, or you can learn how to do it properly. Yes. You know. That's, That's why it was so important to teach those girls when we had them how to pace. True. How to pace, because like I, like I say, I, I could give you some stories about it being late. But like I say, it was that important for us to teach them. Mm -hmm. I, I think we did a fairly good job of, of doing something. Because I and, think we, so we, and we had, and we had, I think at that time, not I think, we had a strong brotherhood in that shack. That's, that's what I'm saying. And I tell you a story. I don't know if you remember this, because we, we were carrying the Bible one year. Of course. Like, yes. If you sleep, you, if you sleep, you get leave. Mind, you get leave, right? If you sleep, you get leave. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, yes, right? And um, I had to go to work, right? So we, 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 I get back to the shack, my costume then built. But that's the type of that's a, that's how we were. Yeah. But after that, babe, if you go if you go to sleep, big man, you get lit. <laughs> 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 pressure, up. Pressure. Up. pressure, pressure. And but but it was and and to me and cause he said it earlier. That's the the love happens in the shack. Yeah. Jungle is in the shack. So by the time you get to Bay Street, man, you you, yeah, that's, you, you that's, celebrate. That's just, yeah, that's just the iceberg on the cake when you go to Bay. How do we? How do you? From where you sit, how do you think we get that brotherhood, that competitiveness, that artistry, those lines, that color, those those <coughs> those? I want to say fabric threads that actually make this thing unique. How do we foster that again and get it? back to the point where as we're seeing these things duplicated. I, I think the older members of all the groups have to go back and, and I mean we, we partly responsible for, for the way things are going in junk, you know, but we have to go back and teach. Mm -hmm. We have to teach. Because like I like I said, if we don't teach, we go we we don't wonder what junk will be like in the next ten years. Yeah, we done scared is that but Uncle Kazi, I mean, it goes it goes back to two things. It goes back to something else as well, though, because you could want to teach and you could teach, right? Uh -huh. But I have to want to learn. Yes, and I have to and I have, and I have to want to do it better, right? Yes. And once I have done it better, the judges have to endorse the work as well, oh, yeah. <clears throat> because the judges, in many respects, are the gateway to yes. what junk new yes. develops into. And if they reward something, the trend goes that way. Uh -huh. If they don't reward something, then probably ain't gonna mess with that. You know what I mean? Uh, but the judges have, uh, when I get an opportunity to speak to them, I tell them they have a, an awesome responsibility. An awesome responsibility. An awesome responsibility. So if you endorse something that, that's on the, on, you know, uh -huh. Not what it should be. Then that's the right. That that's the route. That they got right. Look, because look, look right. Look how much money Jungle Group groups pay now for carving. Exactly. 
when actually the styrofoam was against the rules of the parade at the time when it was introduced. Right. But because it was endorsed, as you say, by the judges, now everybody fighting to, 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 to carve this and carve that. And what we are losing, there was a time when uh, you I could build somebody, you could build somebody's place from a wire. We are losing certain skills. We realize the phrase, nobody could build or a car. No, they look at you like you crazy. See, if you That's say build, right. do, that's right, exactly. <laughs> we used to build everything out of wire and cardboard, and you could uh, uh, feature True. people. True. So, and let me tell you how serious it is. And this is no, this is no slight to the Valley Boys, right? When the Valley Boys brought Let Freedom Rain, I think that's the first. Yes, first, that's the first. Thing. First time, right? The the, the introduction <laughs> of um, um, styrofoam heads yes. and all that. How? What, which year was that? You remember which year? Oh, that? that was probably what? You remember which year was was in the nineties? So we got yeah, find out. Yeah. So think about so, it. What was that? Which you remember the year you guys did Let Freedom Rain? Oh no! That was I somewhere in the nineties. In the nineties, right? Yeah. So. There are people... That was the one with Mandela, right? Yeah, with Mandela, right. Yeah, I think that was part of that five street. I don't remember the exact... Year. And I asked you... <laughs> 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 I asked you... I asked you... I asked you... I I thought that would bring you closer to the I I'm straight. You can't take that, right? But the point is, if you came into Jonkano after that, you know nothing else but Star Yes. Exactly. Okay, I see your point. So you lose. We, if we don't roll the line on certain things, that's how they become lost. Absolutely. This this is where I, this is where I where I slightly disagree with you in terms of a person being wanted. Oh, they want to learn. If this is the craft that we hold sacred, and we said this is the line, mm -hmm. we hold the line. Yeah. If you don't want to do this, you don't participate. Okay. Dad, what do you mean you don't participate? Hold on, hold on. Here's what I mean. When I come to Yashak, I have to do things a particular way, right? Well, yes. Okay. In our shark, and that's how it happens. Okay, and if my shark, your shark, is a part of an organ, is a part of a group, mm -hmm. yeah. And if this group has a particular mm -hmm. standard, and if they're holding their standard, and and if you're not a part of that standard or how they're doing things properly, you won't participate here. So you know what? You, you it's, it's not that option. But that isn't that is oh stick up in one minute. Yeah. We have a telephone call. Let's go straight to the phone lines. Even though we didn't give out the numbers. Thank you for <laughs> calling. We, we got carried away. Thank you for reminding us that this is a call in show. Hello, good morning. Good morning, good morning, Ali. Good morning. My former um, principal and teacher at St. George Green Giants. How are you this morning? I am wonderful. I'm son Corsi, the best man in Colmazin, him and PD in the Netherlands. Amen. And I'm a uh, good morning, Darren. Good morning, good morning. Everything good? Oh, I, I mean, everything is excellent. I didn't this see is, you on Independence Morning. This is, this is Chief Stinking Gold. I know who is it. <laughs> I know who is it. But I didn't see you in the balance for it. I can't come I can't come in the balance. One of them one of them better laugh and they go and cast way up by pass my 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 knee you know. Oh I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah but I got broke leg, man. Man, man, oh, sorry, yeah, sorry to hear that. We could have picked that gas though. No, that's okay. I I, I, I bought this this broke leg, I buy this one of the store market, I was testing it out, that's all come I get it. It was 83. 83? 83. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. it. 83. The Valley Boys came back that same Christmas with Freedom Rain with the three dimensional layers. That's mm -hmm. when JD, J, um, JJ them was, was coming down the road and telling us, hey man, um, or, or, I, I'm not sure it was Freedom Rain exactly, but they was laughing at their heads because you know, they wasn't used to it. Really? And that's when the Valley Boys sweep the parade. That was in 80. I think that was Christmas of 83 or, 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 or something around there about. Mm. When, when you finish, I have a story to, to share with you about that. Yeah, right. No. All right. 
Hello? Go ahead. Um, Tracy Willa Francis made the biggest mistake of his life. Uh, he should have never brought those treaty costumes to the floor. Exactly. Oh, uh, he been paying the price ever since because you cannot get this. Yeah, you paying the price. You remember? You remember? You remember? I thought it was the wrong time to bring them. Yeah, man, I, I, I would have, I would have come with my own kind of style and, and probably spring that on them on a boxing day because I mean, Gus wouldn't have no idea, but you show your hand that early. Well, buddy. You you correct. Well, I mean, that was a big mistake because the one of those wasn't used to the the style form. They tried to hold the Saxons off for that a couple of years, and every time they got the big sheet, they get whooped. That's what why one of them standing you know that was basically one of the part of the five states. <laughs> no, 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 it wasn't. No. I have the results. I found the results. Okay. In, 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 in 1989, the Valley Boys won with the end. Oh, sorry. The beginning. I, no, hold on, hold on. I don't, I don't have New Year's here, so it may be. But the Valley okay. Boys won a Boxing Day 89 with the end. I don't have New Year's. I'll check it. And then it was 1990 where they won with a glorious celebration of freedom. That was okay. 1990. Okay, so what what they what they brought in 84, 83 or 84? 83, you brought portraits of oh. Bahamian nature. 84, the Saxons won with invasion of the arthropods. Oh, that, okay. that, that's uh -huh. a nice one. 85, the Saxons won with let's feed the nation. Valley Boys came back in 86 with Christmas celebration. Boy, that was right, a beat. Was was yeah, was that was a beat. That was a beat. Where you take it go? Where you take go? The frog surrendered. <laughs> yeah. Big man, take that one and go. Okay, well, that's thanks for the correction because I thought it was it was 83 or 84 that we brought the right after the Saxons won on, on the fourth. Yeah, I, I will Lawrence. check for New Year's as well, but... Yeah, uh, the yeah. Lawrence celebration of Christmas Day was the bottom boy, me and Gary Goodman, we were the 10 men. Nice, they were beautiful. Yeah, the 10 men on the bottom. It wasn't yeah. even close. Mm -mm. Exactly. Oh, they were happy. They were happy. They were happy. They were happy. Okay, yeah. then, thanks. Okay, <laughs> thanks for calling, man. We appreciate it. I, I thanks for the memories. I to say because for, for my Saxon friends out there who don't know, Mm -hmm. The Saxons could have never beat the Rally Boys on the Boxing Day morning. Yeah. Therefore, they used to hold back on the New Year's morning. Ah, uh, uh, is that so right? The Saxons came on the New Year's because they couldn't beat us on the Boxing Day morning. Wow. They just couldn't beat us. But before we go to our break, Uncle Gorsi, I got a, I got a, uh, 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 talking about the Saxons, right? I got a note from Kennedy Campbell. What she? <laughs> Big fight. This morning, morning Kendra. Say, let Ronald Sims no. know that the Saxons won five straight best music and she gone. You know, you know, listen, best music is one of them side prize. Okay? That's a side prize, man. <laughs> And now for news of the shark wall. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday greetings goes out to Madam Chairman Christina Muffin Fernanda mm. who celebrates today. Also, we have a happy birthday to Madam Staria Wallace from your family and Grammy Debbie mm -hmm. and Star. Mm -hmm. And to everybody who's celebrating their birthday today and the upcoming week, mm -hmm. we would like to say a special Happy birthday Absolutely. to you. Glad you guys are with us. Mm -hmm. The, the Jokno Development Association extends its heartfelt thanks to all those who made the 23rd annual People's Love and Unity Rush such a smashing success. 
Smashing. 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 Okay. Smashing. Take that. Special okay. thanks to the government of the Bahamas, the Independent Celebrations Committee, the Speaker and Staff of the House of Assembly, the Junkanoo Corporation, New Providence Limited, all participate participating Junkano groups and the proud people of the Bahamas who came out to support and celebrate. Mm -hmm. Remember, go to our YouTube channel, Junkano 242, like and share that channel. We have all the updates. The parade is up. Even our episodes from the past, Junkano 242, is up there on that channel. The countdown. It is Saturday, July the 15th, 2023. What? We are 23 weeks away from Bay. Pressure. Absolutely, Pressure. ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. We are wrapping up. I also We're wrapping have up already. Yeah, we are. It's eleven twenty-two. Oh. I also have a goddaughter who is celebrating a birthday today. Alethea to let Renee happy birthday, darling, and hope you have a wonderful day. And so, ladies and gentlemen, we are talking to. Constello Cleveland Constello <laughs> Quasi <laughs> Fernanda Thank you very much <laughs> Take me this plane No <laughs> Full government name. That's a lot of names <laughs> So the Quasi You rush with the Bali boys Right yeah. Yes You rush, rush with one family Right Yeah I'm going to ask you this question. Mm -hmm. Give me, with the Bali Boys, your most memorable parade. Mm. Give me um, from the from one... Parade or costume? There's a well, slight difference. Well... Slight. Okay, leave it the parade. Back. Let's go to the parade. Right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Right? Give it to me from the Bali. Give it to me from the one farm. And give it to me from what you think was the Saxon's best costume. In your, in your, in your eyes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, that's a good let one. Me, let me start with... with I'll just start with the Saxons and come back. Well, Hindu gods and demons. They, uh, that was that was such a unique costume. Mm. I don't I don't think a lot of people appreciate what, what <laughs> they were looking at that morning. Uh, mm. That that was a game changer. Mm -hmm. um, and which year was that? Seventy two. Seventy two. Okay. Seventy two. Uh, Feed the nation was another good costume. Oh gee. Mm. That was another good costume. Mm -hmm. Actually, uh, they had a few good costumes. Um, mm -hmm. Be the nation invasion of mm -hmm. the arts reports. So on the phone. Um, getting back to now, coming up to the Wally Boys, I'll leave one family for the last. <coughs> um, that first independence rush, man. I mean, here it is, me and Robert in the battle line, <laughs> and Gus yanked us out the battle line. <laughs> Um, use Robert. Robert. This is Rob. B B Rush Robert, 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 Robert Ferguson to yeah. carry the banner. To carry the banner. Wow. Uh, I mean, actually, me and Robert, we did everything together. We moved through the lines together. We took big costumes together. But apparently, he went back into the Bella line. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Actually, um, I we were both taught by, by Mr. Curtis. Yes. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Gould Curtis. Good and morning. we said good morning. We need to talk to him as well. Yes. Yeah. I haven't yeah. seen him for a while. Yes. Good morning. Now, to getting, getting to one family um America morning was my best morning. Big time. <laughs> Mind you, I've, I've come on. Also, Indian morning, I mean, Boy, they I don't know how to do The right. great power. That was our best decorator. Yeah. We did some things. People didn't ever. Well, actually, the there was a new style. Style. It's a style on drum, but it was always style. Because you know what was the biggest around. robbery? The one you ain't called the biggest robbery. Mexico? Was, mm -mm, the, yeah. well, that was a big robbery. <laughs> 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 huh? No, not, no, the angels didn't win. They <laughs> come second. That no. was robbery, too. The biggest <laughs> robbery was the fish. Spellbound did not miss Martins and Mistress of the Deep. The deep. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. That, you know, oh, that's a lot of robberies. Yeah, my God. <laughs> Get on <laughs> my <laughs> We have to go to the phone lines in the midst of the robbery. Hello, good morning. Oh, oh they, they're, they're not yet. Yeah, I they, thought he was the Please. <laughs> Don't mind this bastard yard boy. Please call back. America morning and. You know, America morning was a funny morning because we, I don't know if you remember in those meetings with folks, we had a hard time picking that costume because yeah. every time we get in a meeting, it was a deadlock. Yeah. So, I, I don't know who decided, well, let's go to It was now. not unanimous, yeah. And, and also, I, I got into the and say, well, let me tell you something. You know, red, white and blue. You know, red, white and blue, the world could be the same. You know, we're coming. Yeah. You know, we know. Yeah. That's when my family wanted to be. The first back to back. Yeah, the first back to back. <laughs> yeah. yeah, American. Mm -hmm. American morning was special. Yes, it was. Boy, 
Yeah. Say good morning to Holly and Muffin because they were leading the choreograph line at the time. Man, when they did that spin, it was over. And the music. Uh, oh, stunning, yes, stunning. Good. Stunning. The first year we were born. Morning. Yes. That was Bubbles' theme. <laughs> the funeral. <laughs> when yeah, he, when he come again, to that again, meeting and say, you know what? Funeral. Fu everybody funeral. say funeral. Yeah, you, I you funeral. funeral. But uh, then then you start to talk. You know when that hatch, right? At, uh, at, no, 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 no. no. At, at Bingham's funeral. With, uh, at Boma. Let me mm. rush over to Bingham. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh, that's when right. that hatch. That's, right. yes. that's when that, that idea hatch. Mm -hmm. so I, I yeah. remember coming from Tony's funeral straight to the number picking down and body. He was ready then. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. I'll tell you something. It brings back a memory that I hadn't remembered before. When I was lecturing at the College of the Bahamas from 76 to 80, Gus Cooper was also lecturing at the College of really? the Bahamas, and we used to have constant conversations about... Uh -huh. mm. I don't know his years, but that's when I was there. And I could distinctly remember we were in the yard one day, and we were discussing possible themes, and he said funeral. Mm. But he said, I don't know... How would you bring it? Yeah. And, uh, and, and we share, we share, we share, we share, we share, we do it. Uh, you, you, you know why I laugh? Because that, that, that comes so easy to us. But what you have, you just have to bring the idea. Yeah. Of, uh, but you got to remember this was 76 now. <laughs> Funeral was nowhere near in terms of a Junkaloo uh, theme. Yeah. But, but, but the more you talk about it, you got, you got the flowers, you got the this, you got the that, you know. Hey, look here. Yeah. 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 Uh, uh, I like, I like unusual themes, uh, and, and uh, even if you have a normal, normal quote theme, you got to do it differently. Different perspective. Yeah. You yeah. know, somebody is asking me the question why we don't have those over-the-top themes anymore, <laughs> and I, I, can, I can tell you what it is. Why? You're not round the table, I'm right. not round the table, Darren is not round the table. Oh, that's what it is. <laughs> that's what it is. <laughs> Because of course, because we got a thing stupid now. Don't come around here normally. Look at it. Yeah. But there has to be some fights, eh? What? Listen here. And there was a good fight. I ain't calling here. I'm not calling any name because I'm not picking on any particular group. But there was a theme that was out there. I think it was New Year's gone. Let me tell you something. If I put our I don't hands on that, we did a beating for how they Wait. presented that. Wait, they, I ain't calling no name. We <laughs> were like, shit. Sure. When I saw that, blame. no blame. When I, I saw that, yeah. when I heard it, because you thought that, they were thinking like we would have thought. I said, mother sick, boy sick, boy that. They oh, killed man. that thing. I, I was so that, disappointed. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Boy, if we had ever put our hands yeah. on that. Yeah. Oh, you got to think stupid. Yeah. Back in the day, we always strive <laughs> for excellence. We always, yes. that's, that's, that's what we wanted. Yes. We, we knew what we wanted. And uh, Jackson, you know, his influence continues to be felt. Ah, you take the words right out of my mouth. The, the minute the you world. say, mm, he like that. He used to say, now, don't fall in love too quick. We ain't sure for this guy yet. Yeah. We ain't made a parent yet. And the other thing, he always said, in the, step, in the design team meetings, you cannot use the word can't. can't. You right. cannot yeah. use the word yeah. can't. Yeah. So, so those kind of guidelines we will forever. That's the dreamers, man. That's it. So, Uncle Cause, we are right. No, Our no, time is gone. Start talking no, we we gonna have to have you back. This is clearly a part two. We just it's warming up. Pleasure to, to to be here to talk. I mean, I mean, old it story. story. <laughs> <laughs> call it what it is. <laughs> well, it, it, it was a pleasure, Miss Fraser, yeah. and, and getting to congratulate you on, on your wall of fame in, in person. Thank I mean, you. It's, it's, Thank it's you. Good. That was an honor. I appreciate it. Gentlemen, closing words. Of course, of course we having you back. I will say this to you. <coughs> you have been a great mentor and a friend. I'm Truly. brother. Um, Truly. I definitely appreciated spending that time with you in mm. six months. Right? And even afterwards. Oh, yeah. you know? <laughs> this impact continues That's to bad. be felt by That's all bad. of us. Yeah. Uh, and, you know, I always <coughs> look at you as a silent warrior. Oh, you know? yeah. He don't say much. No, he is a silent no. warrior. No. And if he don't like you, he don't mess with you. No, <laughs> he just walk away. He just walk away. 
<laughs> he just walks away. And you are, in my mind, you are you are a hero and you are a gem, and I appreciate you, my brother. Very uh, nice. Thank you, thank you for that honor. Man. Very I nice. I try to be, I mean, like I said, um, it's no, it's it's no point in, in if you have something inside you, you, you got to share it with the world. Man. Yeah, that, yes. that's how I feel. We have a responsibility. It doesn't matter, <clears throat> my man. What group? What group? The other person rush shit. Just share it. Yes, that's, that's how I feel. There you go. Amen. DF. You obviously have a lot more to contribute mm -hmm. to not only Jalpino but to the country. Uh, yes. I look forward to hearing from you. I, I can't wait until we have you back to actually speak Amen. a little bit more about mechanics of, of this Jalpino phenomenon that we have and mm -hmm. how we can take it, mm -hmm. how we could actually get it back to that standard. Yes, because we want to talk more about your perspective on today's yeah, Jalpino. We, we, we definitely need that insight Very much uh, so. on how we could do it because right now, you, you're talking about 10 years from now. Um, I feel as though we still have the opportunity to do it. We just need that information. Can, can I say one thing? Of course. <laughs> the oh, reason right. why I'm laughing because I had an opportunity to go on there because I like to walk out and look at costumes and here it is. This fella had two blocks. <laughs> two actually blocks trying to buy this costume. The man of the costume. Stop. <laughs> Oh, we got a hot Man, stop. <laughs> Are there Monday morning? No, that oh, yes, was one parade. Yeah. We're trying to balance the costume with two blocks. Gee, it was, was rough. Look at the week better. Boy, we, I, I, don't, I don't know why we get to, to, yeah, where we to that. We're going to have to do some seminars. Yeah. 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 Uh, you're invited next to come back next week. Yes. Let's yeah. continue the conversation. Spring more albums. Spring more albums. Yeah. yeah. Let's yeah. Let's yeah. Let's yeah. Let's yeah. I, I have a, I have a ton of albums. Yeah. Excellent. This is just what I, but I more just want to show you that I, I anticipate <coughs> this guy is a model that's close to the Of course. Yeah. And so, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for being in the Ishak with us this morning. Next week, more of the same. But until then, remember now, Junkanoo 242 is all about you wherever you are in the 242 and the world. And until next week, God willing, let everything we all do prove beyond a shadow of a doubt that we are all proud to be made. And we'll see you next week.